Great. Wait here. This won't take long. Finally. Now we can get off this island. I can't hold a human form for long. You're in danger. This will explain everything. After the disaster, I tried to salvage food and water. One night during a heavy rain, I came across Evan. He was hiding in the old botany lab behind some plants, trying to call someone on the mainland. We immediately joined forces with a common goal, to get off the island and undo the effects of the device. One day, I found Evan burning our findings. I realized his plan was to cover his tracks and leave me alone on the island to rot. I started all this when I allowed the mirror device to reach its full potential. The results were problematic, but we'll improve the design. What? Evan, you're insane. You'll kill us all. On the contrary, the CEO is on her way here now. I just contacted her. We'll escape safely with the device. As for you, the shadows will find you soon enough, and you can join your brother. Mark, I'm so glad to see you. Evan is insane. Do you know where he went? No, but he kept talking about activating the device again. There's only one place you can do that. Follow me. It's true. They're going to reactivate the mirror device. We can't let that happen. This time it'll reach beyond the island. We have to blow it up. The device is in Test Lab 13. There's a service entrance just behind this gate. Problem is, the gate is powered by electricity. We have to turn it off somehow.
device. I can feel it activating. What's going on? It's taking over. Find it and destroy it!
Evan's betrayal proved that Corptex will never allow me to escape the island. I'll have to fight to get the truth out. Luckily, I had my suspicions. I built a failsafe just in time. It can cancel the effects of the mirror device. The only thing that can help us now is four glass prisms hidden in the depths of the lab. Fortunately, the frequency emitted by the device is keeping me from getting close to it. It's up to you, whoever you are, to find a way out. things. The device is playing tricks on me.
I admire your bravery, but I can't let you destroy what we've worked for. This is crazy! That device is a danger to everyone! It will work. Eventually. Evan, take care of the machine. Stop the overload process. You did it! The field is gone, along with the device, and I'm free of those... things. Let's get out of here. Dozens of people, previously presumed to have died on Ambrose Island, survived. They appear to have no memory of the three years that have passed since the incident. Corptech's board of directors deny any involvement in the nefarious experiments conducted in the island laboratories. They claim CEO Rebecca Horton acted independently. Ms. Horton is believed to have perished in the fire that destroyed Corptex Labs, but her remains are still to be found. The full investigation is still pending.